So, <clears throat> there's just one thing I wanted to show you guys. Uh, I, I bought the Condor Golok machete. I uh, haven't actually taken it out of the field yet, and uh, seems like it's going to be pretty good. I got it down to pretty much razor sharp where I can like, shave my arm <laughs> with it, my arm hairs, but um, seems pretty solid, pretty heavy. The problem was, when I first got it, the handle. It's extremely smooth. It's like a, I guess it's a walnut. And uh, I did not like the way it felt. I mean, if, you know, if you see this, it's extremely smooth. And I mean, this is a pretty heavy machete. And it's pretty thick of a, of a handle. I don't have huge hands. Um, so I, I, I just didn't feel comfortable. I felt like it was going to slide out of my hand. And uh, I searched quite a few videos on YouTube. And uh, I, I saw a couple different different things that people did, but most people are just using it, you know, with, with the handle. I actually just bought these. This is a, uh, like a tape that you, uh, it's a self-adhesive camo tape. I was thinking about doing that, but I was like, you know what? This is an expensive freaking machete, and I don't want to have something cheap. So what I did, I just got a real basic uh, Dremel. I bought it at Harbor Freight for $6.99 today, so seven bucks. Comes with a bunch of attachments. This is all I used right here, okay? And this isn't, dude, I have no experience with freaking Dremel tool. Um, not the greatest, but all I literally did was just type, or not type, but I cut these little grooves into it, you know, like a, like a little pattern. I kid you not, it's a complete difference when you hold it I mean it, it feels solid it feels like like you know like you're never gonna lose grip on this you know I don't know how good it'll feel after whacking a, a freaking you know bunch of branches for hours on end but dude it's it's pretty solid for for what I did so I just wanted to share that with you I uh you know I was out uh, I was like I said doing some some YouTube searches for quite a while I saw one gentleman doing kind of a similar pattern but I didn't I didn't like the way he did his and no offense to him or anything but I just didn't like the way I did it um, but this one if you look at it it's just it's not super far in and uh, you know it, it just came out pretty good so just wanted to show you guys that and I, I, I almost did it all the way to the metal on both the top and the bottom so you get your maximum grip okay so just wanted to show you guys that hopefully that helps somebody um, did nothing help me except for that one guy's video and it was just an idea and I, I just did it on my own and I like the way that it came out so okay oh by the way this thing is freaking beautiful like I, I everything on it is just it's just balanced it's perfect if you were thinking about buying it buy it but do this <laughs> it'll make all the difference uh, so okay good luck